The Manson murder spree ended in this remote Death Valley, California cabin called Barker Ranch. It was here that Charles Manson and members of his cult family were hiding out after the so-called Helter Skelter murders that claimed at least seven lives and terrified the country in 1969. It's hiding in the cabinet right here. Now, almost 40 years later, local detective Paul Dosti says he and his dog Buster may have found more Manson victims buried right behind the Barker Ranch. Dosti says that Buster, who's trained to find human remains, found five possible graves. A group of scientists also found evidence of possible remains at three of the same spots. It seems very viable. I would say we have tremendous amount of probable cause to look. Gold prospector Emmett Harder knew Manson and his top lieutenant, Charles Tex Watson. He says rumors about more Manson victims have swirled for years. Stories like the one that Harder says a Manson follower told him. This one girl didn't get along with with uh, Manson or, or Watson at all, and they took her for a walk. And they came back in a short distance, and she we never saw her again. So I would hope that maybe they would find her. We sent letters to Manson and Tex Watson asking if there were victims buried behind Barker Ranch. Manson never replied, but Watson did. In a letter, he told us, quote, I was the first family member to go to the desert after the murders and also the first to leave. I say this only to let you know that no one was killed while I was in the desert, but I don't know what took place after I left. I don't think there were any more killed. I hope not. I have absolutely nothing to hide. One thing to consider is that even if there are bodies found behind the ranch, there's a very good possibility that they'll never be identified. And there's almost no chance that Manson or any of the other family members could ever be prosecuted for murder. Police say there is no one who ever associated with Manson who was reported missing after his arrest. So who could be buried out here is as much a mystery as if somebody's buried out here. Dosti's confident that forensics could identify any remains found. He'll never prosecute Charlie Manson for murder because you found a body back here, though. Really, that's not what we're interested in. I think um, many of these Manson family members are on one-year parole reviews. Uh, there's a lot of movement out there to try to get them out. The decision to dig is up to the local sheriff's department. They say they want more tests done before they spend the time and the money. Of course, without digging, no one will ever know if Buster the dog is barking about nothing or if he's unlocked a Manson family secret. Ted Roland, CNN, Death Valley, California.